Okay guys, I just finished Mahogany Presents The Holiday Stocking. It's the first Christmas movie done by Mahogany. And let me just tell you, over there on Miracles of Christmas, this is the first Miracles of Christmas movie that I'm giving a 10 out of 10. It talked about family, love, unresolved issues, the holidays, it had good singing. Um, I cried so hard at the end, like I can barely talk. This is actually my second take and I usually do my movie reviews in like one take. So once again, I am reviewing last night's 10 p.m. Eastern movie, The Holiday Stocking, starring McKelty Williamson as the older brother Robert that has passed away and now he's an angel. Um, BJ Britt plays rj angel so he comes back in different form on earth and he has 12 days to fix the rift between his two sisters played by nadine ellis and tamala jones so here's the thing that we don't talk about often the holidays are a time where it brings up when we're estranged from loved ones whether it's family and friends unresolved issues and what i noticed with hallmark is that when they do the angel movies, they really dig deep. So for example, Ghost of Christmas Always that premiered on Countdown to Christmas earlier in this Christmas season um, also was very deep and dealt with, you know, the past, the present and the future. This movie dealt with the past and the present. I cried so hard at the end, but it was like one of those happy relief cries because RJ has 12 days to fix the rift between two sisters that are not speaking. And what we end up finding is he had a role in it. Now, the two sisters, um, Danny is, um, okay, give me a second because I'm all over the place. Danny is a uh, major CEO and owner of a the largest, um, you know, black advertising company, I think, in Chicago. And then Danny, the younger sister, inherited, um, no, Marlo, the younger sister, inherited, um, the bakery from their mother. And I'm sorry, I, when I tell you I'm so emotional from this movie, I definitely have to do two parts for the review. So once again, um, Danny is the older sister that's running the advertising agency. And then um, Marlo is the younger sister that is running the mother's bakery. And what we find out is that these siblings had a whole rift about when their mother was sick and when she passed away. And there's this tradition. I'm going to get more into the tradition in part two. But I want to tell you once again that like, I didn't think I was going to cry at the end of this movie, but I cried so hard. But it was one of those cries of relief. Like when I saw that RJ was finally able to, to fix the riff and also admit the part he played in his sisters being estranged.